So today I'm going to make a fruit salad, Filipino style. My ingredients are all fresh. I have a seedless watermelon, then I have banana. Not all of this I'm going to use. And then I have a fresh mango. And a bag of avocado. Then I have condensed milk and evaporated milk. Before I'm going to mix them or cut the fruits, I have to wash them. And I'm adding here a garbage bowl. So when I'm done, I can just easily wrap it and place it in the garbage bin. So just take out the seeds. Then it depends on how big you want to cut your fruits. It's all up to you. The discretion is yours. For me, this is enough. I'll just cut them into cubes. And then make sure you have a mixing bowl. Then just scoop it up. Scoop, scoop it out, I mean. That's it. Then you do the same with the mango. The mango looks good. I hope it's sweet. And just do the same with what I did in the avocado. I just cut the watermelon into half. It says seedless. Unfortunately, I still found some seed. So again it's all up to you up to the size and how you're gonna cut the watermelon for me i'll just take out the part which i don't want to include in it. then Just like that. Same thing with the rest of the fruit. You do the same to the remaining watermelon and until it's all done. So for the banana, you just peel it off. And cut it into half, then into another half. So you can get a good dice cut. That's it. So now, after cutting all of our fresh fruit ingredients, I'm going to mix the other remaining ingredients. So as you can see, I have here one can of condensed milk and evaporated milk. It's the same thing. It's just a leftover, but they're still good. So what will I do? I'm going to pour it in here in a small mixing bowl, the evaporated milk and condensed milk. You might be wondering, it might be too sweet, but the fruits, especially the watermelon, it's not that sweet. So we need something that will compensate with the blend it the fruit so we decided to put this on we just have to mix it mix it well Another can of 
condoms me. It doesn't necessarily means you have to follow the brand that I am using here. I'm not endorsing this brand or whatsoever. It just so happened this is the one available while I'm making this. You can also add a whipping cream if you want, if you don't wish to use this condensed milk and evaporated milk. Those are just your other option. So now I have to mix it again. For now, this is enough. I don't want to add another evaporated milk because I know that the fresh fruit will have more liquid once I'm going to mix this. So just give it a mix. Just mix it well. The other options that you can add is raisins and grated cheese. But for now, I'm not adding those ingredients that I just mentioned. It's all up to you guys if you're going to add cheese and raisins. And when you're doing fresh fruits, please do not add either canned pineapple or fresh pineapple because it, the taste will become bitter. That's it. And then just cover it with plastic wrap and then place it inside your refrigerator and chill it. And it's ready to eat after an hour. So this is how it looks like after covering it with a plastic wrap.